Hey guys, Amy here, and today we have my Throwback 30 update for December. If you want to know what I'm rolling out, what I'm rolling in, everything about this project, then just stay tuned. As always, everything I'm wearing will be listed in the description box. And if you like makeup, unboxings, project planning content with a little bit of horror sprinkled in, please consider subscribing as I would love to have you here. And let's go ahead and roll on into December's update. <laughs> So, if you don't know anything about this project, it is a Fantastic Ladies collab that started on July 28th of this year and goes to July 28th of 2024. It was created by Jessica, and this is the fifth year of it. And if you're not part of the Fantastic Ladies, I always leave their Facebook listed in my description box. But what we did was we took 60 projects and voted down to 30, and those made it into this project. And then you pick one prompt from each of those 30 projects to work on. I randomized all of my prompts from all of these projects in the very beginning. So if you missed my intro, my playlist will also be listed in the description box. So we're just going to go ahead and talk about things that I have, any things that I finished, and anything that I have use on for the month of December. Because December's color was this like teal, and January is going to be this beautiful blue. So let's go ahead and get on into it. So I'm not going to talk about, normally I talk about everything, but I feel like some people find that that's repetitive. So I'm only going to talk about, and let me know how you guys feel, the things that I have progress on for December. If you want to hear all of the products that I have in, let me know. I can always talk about all the things, but we're just going to go on and go forth. So for that So 2000s, that was chunky jewelry, something chunky or bulky, packaging, glitter, etc. And I chose my Slay Fire Glitter. This is one of the mystery glitters. And I've used it. I have a five-use goal on this, and I've used it one time in this month. So it's like a green and red. I was hoping to get more uses out of it because it gave me Christmas vibes, but... I've had this one for over a year, and I just don't think the formula on this one is as good, but I also don't love how chunky this one is. The Slay Fire glitters that I have now that I've bought that weren't mystery glitters are a more fine glitter. I just don't love how chunky this one is, but I'm going to see if I can get my five uses on it. I might just declutter it since it is the end of the year, but I have one use, little to say. For Zodiac Panner, that was Sagittarius, which was subdued dark green, gray, black, or brown. So I picked something black, my Melt Potted Gel Liner in the shade Onyx. It's just a black liner. I have used this one out of my ten uses. So definitely need to get more use on my liners that I've brought into this project. For Skin Is In, that was anything skincare. I have been using my Kopari Skin Melt. I also forgot to grab it because it's in my bathroom, but it's not quite finished yet. So that is the goal to finish it. But I am always working on that in the background. I just thought that I would mention it. There is like, it will be an empty for January because there is not much left of it at all. Like I can see the bottom of it. There's none coating the sides. I would say maybe two weeks more of use. And it'll be gone, if that. So it will definitely be an empty for the next update. For That's Expensive. And it was, I believe, just anything expensive. Yep, any expensive beauty item. And that is what is on my lips today. And that is my Pat McGrath lipstick in the shade Crimson Ecstasy. And I put a 10 use goal on this guy. And... I used it once in the month of December to put me at two out of my ten uses. I'm not a big red lipstick wearer. It goes with the look that I'm wearing. So if I get one use a month, I will not be able to finish that by the finale. So I need to need to be up in my red lipstick wearing. For lip service, I believe that was anything lip 
lipstick lip product any random lip product so I randomized a number from my lip category and it picked my NYX XXL lingerie in Naughty Noir this is my black liquid lipstick and I put a five use goal on this and I said when I rolled it in that when I put it in a different project with a bigger usage goal because it is my favorite lipstick I didn't want to reach for it for some reason so I only put a five use goal on this and I've used it once so We have no rollouts this month, but I'm still going to roll a couple things in because that's that's the fun of this. For Beauty A to Z, I randomly selected the letter S. And for that, I picked my NYX Sweet Cheeks in the shade Nude Tude. And this is just, I'm wearing this today. It's just a very beautiful nude moussey blush. I love this formula. And I put a 10 use goal on this and I've used it 3 out of 10 times. For 50 Shades of Green, that was something green, obviously. And I picked from this St. Angel Sinners and Ice Cream Beauty, the Friendsgiving Palette. This shade Veggies and is actually dusted ever so lightly on my lower lash line today. I wanted to get five uses on that shade, so I am at one out of five uses. Actually, every shimmer that is on my eyes today are from that palette, but that's the only shade I'm working on. For Paranormal Pantivity, I got Demon, a product you were tempted into buying. And for me, that are these e.l.f. shadow sticks. I'm just not a shadow stick wearer, but this is also smudged on my lower lash line, and I really like it. I put a five-use goal on this. This is the brown shade in Melt With Me, and I've used it once. One out of five, so happy with that. For Budget Beauty, something drugstore, I picked my Makeup Revolution Mega Bronzer in the shade 01 Cool, and I wanted 10 uses on this, and I have used it three times. It's on my face today. I really like it. It's a gigantic bronzer. It's going to take me forever. I'm going to have that bronzer forever. And last but not least, oh, that's everything that I've worked on, because I'm not talking about things I haven't worked on. So, how many products do we currently have in? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So, I am going to, since I didn't hit any goals, I'm just going to roll in two new products because I want to keep it even. So I'm going to get into Tiny Decisions, Throwback 30, and we are going to, if I can do it, see what two I get. Tiny Pants! Palette with smallest pan size or smallest weight. Alrighty. And what else do we get? Ooh, Disney Princess. And that is Belle. So something yellow or white. So I'm going to go off real quick, find those items, and I will come back and we'll talk about them. So I'll be right back. All right, so that was actually a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. So for tiny pans, this has the smallest pans and the smallest weight. This only is 2.3 grams, and it is a trio. This is from Lovecraft Beauty, and this is the Muted Techno Trio. So I will go ahead and swatch it for you. So we have two mats and shimmer. So that's the trio there. And my goal is, and this might be in until the finale, but I want to try to hit pan on one of the shades. It might be the shimmer 
or it might be this mat because it came broken. So there's already like, I would already technically have a head start on that mat, that darker brown. But this would actually pair very nicely with my pan that palette project that I'll be doing, which you guys will be seeing come January 1st. So this is going to be going in for a hit pan goal just on something in here. So we have that. And then for Disney Princess, like I said, I got Belle, so something yellow or white. This is the Pretties for Your Face Flare shade. I actually just repressed this because mine broke. So I already had it out on my desk and I was like, if I already have it out, I might as well use it. It's such a beautiful shade. It's a yellow with like a pink. Is it pink or is it purple? I think it's pink with a pink sparkle and it's just, it's so pretty. So that's the shade Flare. And I'm just putting that in for a five use goal because since this broke and I salvaged a lot of it, there is so little in here that I want to savor what I have. So I feel like five uses, I might even hit pan with five uses. So those are going to be the two items I'm going to bring in. I'm still working on so many things, but we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine prompts left. So we're doing good. I'm, I'm happy with my progress. As long as I touch all of the projects, I will be very happy. So I hope you guys enjoyed this a little shorter but sweet update, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys.